Um, but I'd like to take this opportunity to um, thank specifically uh, Gordon Goldsboro from the Manitoba Historical Society, their support, uh, Gordon McBean from the Manitoba Archaeological Society, Chris Weeb from the National Trust for Canada, all our speakers, you were excellent. I know we couldn't really touch on everything we needed. Some of the comments certainly are, we, we need a more in-depth conversation, but I love the diversity, the topics, and we've started the conversation. And I do wanna let the audience know again that we would like to include the city committee. We wanna work with the city. The city is wonderful. And, and I know that they care about our built heritage and certainly the Bay Building. So we'll be reaching out to that committee. Also the Hudson's Bay Company representatives to talk to them. And uh, certainly we would um, you know, want to engage um, these conversations with the nonprofit and the heritage sector. So we're hoping, as I mentioned before, there'll be a Manitoba Heritage Summit in the fall. We'll keep you posted. And we'd like to do another um, presentation on the Bay downtown. So uh, we also had uh, promised you that we would do a book draw for George Mitchell's brand new book, Winnipeg's Historic Exchange. It's a beautiful photographic book. And I pulled up somebody who stayed till the end. I hope they're still here as Karen Enns. Um, that is who won the raffle draw for the book. So they can just, she could reach out to Heritage Winnipeg and we'll happy to make sure that she gets this book. And I think unless I've uh, forgotten anything, uh, we are ending right at two o'clock. So thank you again for everybody. And thank you for your patience for a few of the IT problems we had. Um, but I think overall, again, Thank you to the participants, the Winnipeg ones and the national ones.